Hi guys! Anyone that manages an auction-based website often has to deal with users that after bidding and winning, withdraw and do not pay for the one item. Thanks to the integration between our plugins, Yid Auctions for WooCommerce and Yid WooCommerce Stripe, you're going to be able to allow bids only from users that have a valid credit card added to their profiles. And after the auction ends, you're going to be able to automatically charge their credit cards for the one item. This process will allow you first to reduce the number of bids that you get from users that are really not interested in the auction. And second, you're going to be able to automate payments and reduce the amount of unpaid items. Before we get into it, let me remind you, of course, to like this video, subscribe to our channel and hit that bell down below so that you know every time we have a new video for you. Now, let's get to it. Okay, so we're on my auction-based website and here I have four auctions that are currently running. You see that here I have the countdown, I have the date when the auction ends and I have the bid now button. So the options that I want to show you in this video are located in my dashboard. So let's go to the dashboard, ETH, Auctions, General, Auctions Payments. As you can see here, the first section has the Stripe options. They are currently disabled because, as you can see in this message, I need to install our Yeet WooCommerce Stripe Premium plugin in order to enable this section. So, let's go activate that plugin. Let's go to Plugins. I already installed it here, so let's look for Stripe right here. There, Activate. Great, so the plugin is active now. Let's go back to Yeet Auctions, General, Auctions Payments. Now I do have this section enabled. So this first option, force users to add a credit card before placing a bid, will show a message to any user that wants to place a bid, asking him to add a valid credit card in order to place the bid, okay? Otherwise, he just won't be able to do it. Let's enable this. And right here in this text editor is the message that the user is going to see in his My Account page before adding the credit card information. You can edit the text, change the format, anything you want. I'm going to save here and we're going to see how this works. We're going to go back to the site, but in this browser, I'm logged in as a regular user that doesn't have a credit card added to their My Account page. So we're going to scroll down and I'm going to select one of these auctions to place a bid. So I'm entering this auction page to try and place a bid. You see here that I'm just not able to type the amount that I want to bid. And that's because I, as a user, do not have a credit card added to the payment methods section of my account page. And right here in red, I have the message you need to add a valid credit card in order to bid. And here's the add a credit card link that will redirect me to my account page to add that credit card. Now, let's see the other options that we had available with this integration between our auctions and Stripe plugins. Back to the dashboard. Now, if we scroll down, we have another option right here. Charge the winner's credit card automatically after winning the auction. I'm going to enable this option because this is exactly what I want to do. When an auction ends, the plugin will automatically charge the price of the one item to the credit card of the auction winner. And below this option, we have another text editor with a customizable text. This text will appear below the text we saw before. So this will be shown in the payment method section of the My Account page of that user to inform users that in case of winning, we're going to charge the price of the item to their credit card. Obviously, they have to know this and agree before bidding. We're going to save these options right here. And I'm going to go back to the site as a regular user that doesn't have a credit card added to their My Account page. So I'm back on this auction. The current bid is 135. I have the countdown right here. And here I have this 
message you need to add a valid credit card in order to place a bid i'm going to click here on add a credit card and i'm being redirected to the payment methods section here are the two messages we enabled with the stripe options both are visible only in this section and here are the fields that i need to complete in order to add the credit card to my account if you remember this is the sentence that i changed to bold this is the message that's added when you enable the option to force users to add a credit card and this one is the message that is added when you enable the option to charge the winner's credit card automatically so i'm going to add stripes test credit card and then i'm going to click here on add payment method the payment method has been successfully added i'm going to go back to the auction so i'm back in the auction page but now i'm a user that added a credit card to my account page so if i scroll down i'm going to see that i have the option to place a bid now and the message and the link to add a credit card are gone we can see right here that the current bid is 135 so i'm going to bid 150 and as you can see right here i'm the highest bidder for this auction with a maximum bid of 150 dollars what i'm going to do now is send this auction from my dashboard by changing the auction's end date to today so i'm going to do that and then i'm going to refresh this page great so now as you can see i'm the highest bidder for this auction and i won the auction with the highest bid of 150 dollars so what happens next stripe is now going to charge this paintings price to my credit card as the auction winner the price of course is going to be the amount that i offered 150 dollars and i'm also going to receive this email stating that i won the auction how much i offered and that my credit card will be automatically charged for the item's price so everything worked as a charm and as you saw, using this integration is very easy. You just need to activate both premium plugins and enable those two options. Then the plugins will work automatically to improve the security of your auction-based website. Okay guys, so that's how you can use our plugins integration on your auction-based website. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please give this video a big thumbs up and we'll meet again for our next video.